Hello everybody. OK, so today is arithmetic test day. Let me talk you through what is expected. Are you ready? All right, so this is a paper one equivalent to a practice SAT test that we've started to do prior to lockdown. Let's go through a few of the rules and regulations. OK, instructions. Firstly, you may not use a calculator, so don't head for your mobile phone, the calculator part there, mm -mm, use your brain. Questions and answers. You have 30 minutes to complete this test. More of that in a moment. Work in as quickly and carefully as you can. And then it says about putting your answers in the box. Well, obviously you don't have the paper in front of you, so you might want to pause the screen so you can answer each of the questions and then write your um, answers and your workings out in your homework books. OK, all answers should be given as a single value. For questions expressed as common fractions or mixed numbers, you should give your answers as a fraction or a mixed number rather than converting it, say, to a decimal. If you can't do a question, it says go to the next one, you come back to it later. And if you finish before the end, please make sure you check your work. But I guess that's not appropriate. Check your work anyway. Now, in terms of marks, the number under each box at the side of the page tells you the maximum number of marks for each question. And in this test, the long uh, division and multiplication questions are worth two marks. So you will be awarded two marks for a correct answer. And one of those marks has got to be showing the method, the formal method that you've used. All the other questions are worth one mark. And again, always check your work. Now, uh, a little bit of advice about the 30 minutes timings. Don't worry, these aren't the normal conditions for having a practice SATS test. So if you need more time, go for it. We've not got the usual conditions. So my advice really, any time between 30 minutes and 45 minutes is ideal. But just have a go, every question. All right, so here we go. I'm going to talk you through each of the slides which shows you the questions and then it'll be your turn to go back to the start of the test, pause the screen, have a go. Here we go. First part of the test. Here we have questions one to six. Seven to twelve. Questions 13 to 18. Questions 19 to 23. Two marker there on question 23. 24 to 28. And now there are two more questions to go. Question 29 and 30. So at this point, this is the end of the test. Now, I want you to find out how you got on. So when you've completed your test, here's the mark scheme. All I ask of you is to try your best. So, that's the end of my short presentation. Go back then to the beginning of the test, question one, pause the screens, have a go at answering them. All right, my friends, we'll see you very soon. Good luck, and I look forward to hearing how you've gotten on. Bye for now. <laughs>